The meeting was to consider the finance ministry's proposed alternative offer for pension funds in a new debt restructuring program after it had after it had written to the Board of Trustees of Pension Funds. According to government, the offer is necessary to save the economy from further decline. Some labor unions had served notice not to participate in the new deal, just as resolved in December ahead of the domestic debt exchange program. Organized labor reaffirmed their earlier position. We therefore urge the Board of Trustees of all pension funds not to honor the invitation to participate in the so-called alternative offer for pension funds. Any attempt by government or the Board of Trustees of Pension Schemes to undermine the MOU will, fiercely, will be fiercely resisted by organized labor. The leadership of organized labor further urges all organized labor groups to close ranks and abide by the tenets of the MOU we have signed with government. This is a national security matter, and we cannot take it lightly. And therefore, organized labor, we are saying that the arrangement we had with uh, uh, government, we still stand by it. And if government feels that it has any other plans, it can come back to the table where we signed the agreement. Let them come and do their presentation. We will look at it. We will go back and consider if it is something that is reasonable, and we think that it is in the best interest, and I repeat, it is in the best interest, of our working colleagues who will be going on it. I mean, fine, so be. But if it is not in their best interest, then certainly it will not see the light of day. Thank you. The Civil and Local Government Staff Association of Ghana confirmed their new position. You have just signed an MOU saying calling for, and as a position of organized labor, which you are part. And the MOU is saying that the government should come better and explain further, and all labor union groupings and their fund managers should stay away from this new arrangement. How do you synchronize the two? Well, like organized labor has said, what organized labor is saying is that based upon the MOU that was signed, the government should come and make a presentation to them on the proposals that they are they've given to the board of trustees. Well, it's fair. It's, it's once you sign an MOU with organized labor, it, it's very needful that you also present to them this proposal. What I'm saying is for CLOSAC, based upon our investment portfolio, we don't have a problem. But don't you think it compromises your position? It doesn't compromise my position. I spoke for CLOSAC. And now if there are other schemes within organized labor that has got a problem, it's my duty to also talk for them. 